What's up guys, I'm Random Frank P, and today we're going to be checking out the new 2019 LG Gram laptops. We have both the 17 inch and the 2 in 1 14 inch model. And every year they kind of refresh their product line, so I figured get my hands on them, check them out for you guys. Because in the past, I've dubbed these really, really great for students because they're so lightweight and so powerful. So we'll check out the new 2019 refresh, go over it all for you guys today. But first we'll check out the 17 inch LG Gram and then from there we'll kind of transition into the smaller 2 in 1 just kind of make the whole video flow easier. But as for the LG Gram product line as a whole, what I just alluded to, they have been known for their laptops being so lightweight and that's still going to be the story here despite the 17 inch screen. They use this magnesium alloy and this model comes in at just 2.95 pounds. I've always been a fan of that kind of like darker metallic silver finish it has going on. And you have the simple just Gram branding there for the LG Gram. I think it's a nice and sleek touch. But visually, it does look pretty much unchanged from last year. Now as for the display, one thing I really like is what they've done with the laptop itself is how they fit the 17 inch screen of this model into a 15.6 inch body. And if you're asking yourself like what, that doesn't make any sense. The screen is a 16 by 10 aspect ratio at 2560 by 1600. So you're pretty much getting more vertical screen real estate now. That's gonna make this great for having, you know, two windows up side by side. So you're researching on one and you have your, you're typing your paper up on the other one. We're gonna sort of multitasking here. You're just gonna greatly benefit from having the ratio like this. And even for creators, say you're editing like, you know, photos or videos and you're working in a timeline. Well, now you have more screen to work with. We do get an upgrade in the actual quality of the screen itself with sRGB now over 96% color grammet with 300 nits. So a brighter screen with more accurate coloring. The keyboard layout remains unchanged. You still have the backlighting and stuff with the chiclet keys. You even got the numpad to kind of complement the bigger body of the laptop. Plus we have the integrated fingerprint reader on the power button. Always a fan of that, extra level of security. And check out the connectivity on the left side is the power input, USB 3.0, HDMI and Thunderbolt 3. So you can hook this up to like an external display, 4K, 5K, all that good stuff. Then on the right side are two additional USB ports, the headphone jack and a micro SD card slot. As for specs in this model, we have the Intel i7-8565U CPU, which can be turbo clocked to 4.6 gigahertz. So if you push this thing, you're gonna definitely notice that performance bump. We have 16 gigs of RAM with a 512 gigabyte N.2 SSD and Intel's integrated UHD 620 graphics. So not necessarily a, you know, gaming machine, but you still can do some light gaming at medium to lower graphical settings, depending on the game. The speakers haven't been improved, but internally they now use this DTS Headphone X sound card, which is gonna deliver better sounding audio than previous iterations. So the headphone users here can definitely take advantage of that. Then lastly, before we move on, we'll talk about the battery life. And they have this rated at like 19 and a half hours, they said, with their 72 watt hour lithium battery. Uh, for me though, my testing, it was more so around 16 hours average, but you know, again, that's still pretty good because you have this large 17 inch display. So unless you're using this at like a really low brightness, then yeah, you're really not gonna get 19 and a half hours. But I mean, think about it for students or for your work day, odds are that 16 hour battery life is gonna last you more than enough for that day. And they're also doing this uh, LG campaign right now. So if you wanna get your hands on the new LG Gram 17, you can take part in their hashtag scale up idea photo contest. All you have to do is post a photo to your Instagram. It's gonna creatively show your thoughts, either their screen size, lightweight frame, or their long lasting battery. You can just add the hashtags, either hashtag scale up screen, hashtag scale up lightweight, and hashtag scale up battery. And you can win one of three 17 inch LG Gram laptops with the deadline being March 7th. And additionally to the Instagram scale up quiz, if you check out their YouTube channel, they're also running a campaign where they're giving away $130 Amazon gift cards. So I figured I'd talk about that real quick to give you guys a chance to win either the laptop or the gift cards running through the 14th through February 27th, so good luck. And now we're gonna talk about the 14 inch two in one. This one's pretty cool because you can have it like a standard laptop or flip it around and use it now like a tablet. This one's definitely more my speed. So I checked this out at CES, if you remember my video, and I was really pumped when they showed this off because they are also using it with a stylus pen, which is also from Wacom or Wacom, however you wanna say it, meaning creators out there can finally put their creativity on display, literally. This obviously, as the name implies, is 14 inch, and it's a 1920 by 1080p touchscreen panel. It's actually protected with this Corning Gorilla Glass 5, 
So that means if you're using it with the stylus, you're not gonna be leaving any marks or scratches. Physically, it looks pretty much the same. You have that same keyboard layout as these smaller models do. It has the integrated backlighting. You still have the fingerprint reader. And for connections on the left side is the charging port, the USB slot, HDMI, and Thunderbolt 3. Then on that right side is another USB, the headphone jack, a sleep wake button for when you have this and you're using it like in tablet mode and the micro SD card reader. But the biggest difference here with this two in one is as I showed you, you can double it as a tablet, making it more versatile. The hinge here allows for this complete 360 degree flexibility. So you can use it as a regular laptop, a tablet, use the keyboard as a stand or in tent mode. All this in the laptop still comes in at just 2.52 pounds. So it's still really lightweight to carry around with you. This one has the same specs as that 17 inch model. So still powerful, but in a smaller form factor. But we actually get a bump in the battery performance. Again, it's the same actual battery from the 17 inch model. But with a smaller screen here, I averaged around 18 hours compared to their 21 hours testing. So a tiny bump, but hey, two hours is better than no hours. That was stupid. So with this, my biggest thing has just been getting into that creative mode by using the stylus here. It's actually the Wacom AES 2.0 stylus, and it has 4,096 different levels of pressure. So when you're using this, I feel like, you know, your, your inner creative can really come out. Artists can definitely appreciate that, whether it's for, you know, graphic design or just, you know, jotting down notes for school or jot down some cool little drawings and stuff. Anything like that, having a stylus, once you get used to it, is really, really cool. Uh, it even has like the forward and backward buttons. You can change to do like undo your previous stroke and stuff. And it lasts like months and months and months on end. Uh, I personally like having a stylus, especially mixed with this uh, form factor here. My only gripe about this is it's not like magnetic or doesn't like magnetically attach to the laptop, but that's okay. So personally, I think they're both worthy upgrades over the previous generation LG Gram models. And that's just one thing every year that I can appreciate is that the LG Gram is just constantly improving. I really just do wish that the screen wasn't as wobbly, but again, I get it, I get it. You know, having this lightweight form factor with that magnesium alloy, some materials have to be lighter like that. So if you can kind of overlook that screen wobble here and factor in the fact that it's still very powerful for the small, compact, lightweight size, I think it's a great pickup. I've always said every year I've checked these out that students could really, really take advantage of this. Because at the end of the day, when you're carrying around laptops and books, the last thing you want to have in your backpack is an extra larger, heavy laptop. So having something thin and lightweight like the LG Gram definitely gets a thumbs up from me. And these are the ones that I showed off today. They are spec to the ones that I said. So obviously you can check out uh, different models that have different specs, for different prices and all that stuff. But yeah, that'll wrap it up for my review and kind of checking out the 17 inch LG Gram and the 14 inch two in one. Hope you dig it. And I'll have all the info for the, uh, the scale up challenge and the quiz down below for you guys. So you could check it out running on their Instagram and YouTube channels. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up to show your support. Feel free to follow me on Twitter at random Frank P. And last, if you haven't already hit that subscribe button. Well, I'm random Frank P. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.